welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my fall fashion and beauty must-haves. I'm gonna go ahead and start off with beauty first just because I only have a few things to share and then we'll go into fashion. So let's just get started. The first thing I wanted to share with you guys are eyeshadows. So I just feel like once it starts getting colder, I play with colors a lot more. So I wanted to share with you guys like three palettes that I have been absolutely loving lately and i think they're just perfect for fall and even winter first one is actually what i have on my eyes right now and it is the persona palette i love this palette i got this last year and i think it is one of the best palettes i've ever owned the colors in this palette is just amazing it gives you neutrals that you need and also all like the dark so you can like really play it up I really really just love it um, it's really perfect for all year round if you ask me so if you're wondering what's on my eyes right now I actually have charming on mixed in with audacious so it kind of pulls in all that brown and like coppery orangey colors and then I just use humble on my brow bone and yeah that's it all these three colors right here to do this eye look it's super easy and just I love it and of course like you have all your purples perfect for fall so yeah this has been my go-to lately so perfect for fall season and then these are the other two palettes right here they're both from Marc Jacobs I love this one the most so this one right here is called editorial and it has beautiful greens and this beautiful gold right there I actually posted a picture recently on Instagram using this palette I just love it so much. It's totally perfect for fall. The greens are just beautiful. It just blends well all together. It's just like fall in a palette. And this is another one. This is called Glambition from Marc Jacobs. And this one is really just neutral. That is so beautiful. So this is the other palette I've been going to. And I don't know. I don't have much to say about this. It's just a beautiful like neutral palette. So those are the three palettes I have been using lately and loving and they're definitely a must-have for me for fall just because the colors are so rich, you know what I mean? I love them. For blush, I have this. This is it. This is just like my favorite blush ever. Seriously, I looked at my collection and I'm like, what is a fall blush? And this is what I think a fall blush is. It's like that mauve beautiful color and you can totally build this up. It is Mood Exposure by Hourglass. Honestly, my favorite blush in the entire world. I love this so much. And then we have highlights. I love me some good highlights. I love Jouer. I love Hourglass. But lately, these two are what I've been using the most. Ah. So this one right here is from Dior. I love this. You can see I've used this quite a bit. So this is the Dior Skin Air Luminizer in the color number 3. It is just Stunning. I love mixing this with any highlights that I use like it could be like the Jouer one That's like really pigmented. I would still top it off with this. I don't know. It's just this it kind of adds that Added BAM. I don't know. It's just so beautiful So I love this Dior highlight if I was to make my own highlight this would be it right here I love it so much and then if I want just a little bit like more natural look this is what I've been loving. This is Heart Highlight with e.l.f. Cosmetics. I think it is stunning. So you have coffee and cream and it's just, it's beautiful you guys. Like whenever I use it, I mix the two together and I do have it on right now actually. So there you have it. That's what I'm wearing right now. I love it. I think it's so good. I love how you can wear this every day but also be able to build it up if you want like an intense highlight. So... Good job, heart. Love this a lot. I have here some lippies. This was very hard for me because you guys know I am a lip junkie. Seriously, I have so many. It's, it's ridiculous. So I just went ahead and took these out of my purse. And yeah, it's pretty much my go-to um, for the season. So what I'm wearing right now is actually by Hourglass and is in the color I'm Addicted. So this is what's on my lips right now. And then this one right here is from Makeup Forever. It is a liquid matte lipstick. Um, and it's just a beautiful kind of like mauve orange-ish color. Wow. Um, but you know what I mean. It's so pretty. Totally perfect for fall. And then these two, I really, really have been loving. I've been wearing this even before fall. It is both from Burberry. So what I like to do is apply... 
So this one right here is actually called the Lip Color Contour and it's in the color medium. I've talked about this before, but pretty much it is like a pencil. And you're supposed to contour your lips with it or line your lips with it, but you can go ahead and fill in your entire lip and you're good to go with this. The color payoff is amazing and also it doesn't dry out my lips. So this is what I've been using as lip liner as of the past like month or so now. I really, really love this. And then this right here is their liquid lip velvet lippy in the color number five which is fawn it's really really good i love this color you can wear them both together and they match perfectly or not <laughs> but yeah i love this it also lasts quite a bit on your lips even through eating and stuff so yeah those are my top four lippies and last beauty product that i wanted to mention is my perfume this is something i got recently and it is so strong that i'm like yep you only need one spray with this and it's it's perfect it's the strongest perfume i own i feel like it's amazing i love it it smells so good it's hard to describe but i'm gonna tell you now it's fresh but also a little spicy for me and just the strongest perfume I own. Like, I don't know how else to describe it. It's It smells so freaking good though. So I will have the notes written over here on the side so you can kind of get an idea. But this is the Eau de Moselle, um, the Givenchy. It's the Angelique perfume. I believe this is new. I could be totally wrong, but I just got it and it's ugh, so good. First of all, the bottle is beautiful, and here's the spray. I guess it looks like that. So it's just all black. Seriously, this is the strongest perfume that I own. It smells so good, and you only need one spray. And it lasts all day long, you guys, and I've gotten a lot of compliments whenever I wear this too, so it's, it's a good one. All right, so now on to the fashion part of the video. I'm so excited for this. It's kind of like my favorite thing. So I'm going to go ahead and start off with cardigans first. So this first one is actually my all-time favorite right now uh i wear this almost every day and it is this cardigan from charlotte russe and i believe this was only 18 dollars 20 18 dollars around there so very affordable it is slouchy as you can see the sleeve right there you kind of have like a bat wing thing going on but then the sleeve is pretty tight so i love that look and then it does have pockets here on the sides like on both sides so a very nice long cardigan i believe i have a photo wearing this i'll go ahead and insert it over there so you can see but love this so much another one i've been loving is this super chunky one that i got from zaffel and i love this but also kind of hate it at the same time because it has like a bat wing so sometimes it just literally falls off like so it looks like i'm just wearing like a little shawl if that makes sense it's really weird um i think it's just like how it's made but i do love it because it is so nice and chunky and it looks so good in pictures and it does really keep you warm like i get pretty hot in this because it is so chunky so this is gonna be really good for even through the winter all right so other than cardigans i love me some like sweaters and like sweater knits and things like that so we have a few here this one i have been seeing all over and i had to get me one when i saw it so this one specifically i got from charlotte ruse i really like the color um and it was on sale when i got it i believe 20 dollars um so yeah it has the bell sleeves you guys it's so nice tuck it into any skirts or jeans and you will be golden so cute i love it it's like thick enough but not super thick too so you can really tuck it in comfortably so yeah i love it i love the sleeves on this it's so nice and flowy okay and then we have this one i got this a few years ago from air Postal, and it's still my favorite crop top sweater but it's like a turtleneck as well but it's kind of more like a cowl neck if you wear it uh so it's really pretty i love it it does get fuzzy but it doesn't like go on your clothes really and it's also not itchy so i love this i actually have this in other colors um but yeah it is cropped so you have to kind of wear it with high-waisted jeans or leggings or skirts whatever you want um yeah i don't know i really love this i wore this one all the time 
and it's just really comfortable and again it's not itchy and it's not see-through a lot of knits like this are see-through like the next one I'm gonna show you is a little see-through but this one I can get away with just wearing a bra underneath and you know you can't see anything so I love this one it's from Aeropostal I don't know if it's still available because like I said I got it a few years ago but it's seriously my favorite um, cropped sweater. I wear this one like every year. I love it. And then this one right here is the slouchiest. I love me some oversized sweaters. So this right here is super, super oversized. As you can see, I do have a photo with this one on. So you can totally wear this like off the shoulder. You definitely have to wear something underneath it because I'm not sure if you can tell, but it is pretty see-through. It is like a thinner knitted material, but I, just, I still love it. I think it's really cute. And again, it's super big, slouchy, off the shoulder, whatever you want. It's super cute. You guys should definitely follow me on Instagram because lately I've been posting more outfits so you can get more ideas. And yeah, I really see what I wear, I guess. So yeah, definitely follow me. So anyways, I also love me some basics. You guys know me. I love my t-shirts and things like that. Things I can layer with. So I went ahead and stocked up on this t-shirt from Target. It's from the brand Massimo. And I always get it in a size large because I love the baggy look. And these are just amazing. They're long enough so you can tie them or tuck them in comfortably in your jeans. They're so good. And I believe when I got this, it was only like four or five dollars. It was on clearance. So definitely a steal. Definitely check out your Target. I love this and it's super, super soft too. So you can't go wrong with these t-shirts from Target. Next, I have been really trying my hardest to wear more skirts because I do have a few fall skirts and yeah, I'm just like, I really need to just start wearing them because they are so cute. So, I have here, I believe I got this one from like Ramui or Shein, one of those websites. I'll try and find it and link it for you guys, but it is just like a suede or corduroy or whatever. I think this is suede, yeah. Suede material, skirt, really cute. You can definitely wear like long sleeves on top of this and just tuck it in, a basic tee, whatever you'd like. And then some booties and you'll be good to go. Same with this one. It kind of has the same shape. Um, this one has pockets in the front and it does have that tie detail right there. I got this one from Kohl's last year. It's from the Lauren Conrad line. And is extremely comfortable and very flattering. So I love this one. I actually wore this at the AMAs last year. So I'll insert a photo so you guys can see how I styled it. But... I love this skirt. I think it's really cute. Um, I got this one. This is brand new, but I really want to share with you guys because we're talking about skirts anyways. And I'm pretty sure this is going to be like a go-to outfit for me for date nights. So, I got this black skirt. It's like that suede material and it has all these really cute detailing with the zippers. And on the back it has pockets and it does have a belt as well. So you can totally cinch it in at the waist if it's a little big. But... Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to wear this with this sweater right here. So this is a off-the-shoulder sweater. I showed this to you guys before. And it's cropped, but I think it would look good like tucked in with the skirt. So I cannot wait to try that out and see how it looks. Yeah, I love these sweaters too. It's just like a, seriously, off-the-shoulder sweater. That's it. And they're cropped, so you can easily like tuck them into like, high-waisted skirts or jeans. So I love this. I actually have this in other colors. That is it for clothing. Now on to shoes. So I'm still wearing my Sam Edelman like mules. I wear those every single day if I want to look casual but still kind of put together. Those are the shoes that I wear. But if I want to step it up and wear something with the heels, then I wear these booties. So I got these recently from Amazon and I've been loving them, wearing them nonstop. This is the first pair that I got. It's so cute. And seriously, you guys, this was around like $20, $25. So very inexpensive and they are extremely comfortable and they do come in other colors as well. So that is this one. I believe this is just the color nude. And I just love it. They're so comfy and I love that it has a higher heel and just so comfortable. I can walk in these all day. I also got this. This is my other pair of booties that I've been wearing lately. They're so comfortable. So the other ones go right 
kind of underneath your ankle this one's go right above your ankle because as you can see it is higher um but yeah also the heel on this is a little bit higher but they're still very comfortable i love the peep toes it's just so cute and yeah this one has like that swedish material these are just really comfortable and i love them um so yeah, those are the two booties I have been wearing lately. And once it gets colder, this is my babies right here. These are my over-the-knee boots. Surprisingly enough, I got this on Amazon last year and I absolutely love them. I wore the crap out of them last year. I don't know if you can tell, but I seriously wore this almost every single day last year and I even brought it to Europe with me and it is what I wore throughout the whole trip there. It's just so comfortable and I love how seriously they're so tight on your legs and they just they just fit so well so i love these um i got them in a size five and a half i believe that is the smallest size they make but they they're perfect because um i wear thick socks with these so i love it um i have room you know so yeah, I love these over-the-knee boots, and I believe these were only $70, so they're very affordable, and again, I wore them so much last year. I love it so much that I got it in taupe color as well. And if you're wondering, I do have like this plastic organizer thing inside, so it stands up right, but yeah, so these are the taupe color ones. I love these boots, you guys. Seriously, definitely check them out. They're such good quality. If you look on Amazon, they have such good reviews. All right, last but not the least are my fall handbags. I have two that I have been switching on and off with. The first one is the Louis Vuitton Never Full. You guys have seen this a million times here on my channel. It's seriously my go-to for all year round. I just think the monogram print is such a good neutral and you know it's so fall I feel like. I love the browns. Really whenever I'm carrying a lot of stuff with me, this is my go-to bag. I just love this. You can fit so many things inside and i love how it's like so durable so that's the neverfull mm and then this is my new baby this is my sienna mm which is my everyday bag i freaking love this i've been seeing it a lot on instagram and i was like all right we we need that bag that bag right there it's so beautiful and it is so perfect look at her oh so good so i will link it for you guys down below i just you guys should get this and we can be twinsies but seriously you will love this bag it's so pretty and i don't have to worry about it when it's raining like oh it's such a carefree bag i love it so much and look at my keychain it's from la Dure. i purchased it when i went to new york so it's kind of like my little souvenir but oh my gosh you guys this bag is beautiful. Like, I just want to show you the interior because it's red. Like, it's so beautiful. So, this has been my everyday bag. And, yeah, it's it's my fall bag. I love it so much. It's so beautiful. Ah, let me know down below if you want to see what's my bag. Um, I love doing those. So, yeah. That's that. So that wraps up this video, you guys. I think that's it. That's everything. That's all my must-haves for fall. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that I gave you some ideas on what to wear for fall. And yeah, I just really hope that you liked it. If you have any questions, video suggestions, feel free to leave it as a comment down below. Also, don't forget to hit the like button because that really helps out my channel and really lets me know like what kind of videos you like and don't forget to subscribe as well so thank you so much for watching i love you guys so much and really hope to see you all in my next video bye